There's a lot happening. I think uh, what really pleased me recently was when the industry got together with the FSC and Superfriend and made a really comprehensive submission to the Productivity Commission on mental health and what everyth and everything that the life insurers, uh, life insurance sector is doing in mental health. I think a lot of people don't know that we're actually the biggest contributor and supporter of people with mental health conditions other than the government sector. So a lot of people don't realise in fact how much support we do provide. The Life Code 2 is going to make it clear that we have to take into account both the severity and the history of the individual when we're underwriting and that's going to be written into the code and actually that reflects current underwriting practice. So um, it's disheartening when you hear that doctors are telling people not to get treatment because of life insurance implications and it's really it's quite irresponsible actually because if people need treatment for, for a mental health condition or they need help to get them through a personal crisis they should definitely reach out and get that help.